I wanted to go to the studio today, but then I'm just like, eh, like, it's, it's, it's away. Like, let me enjoy my little freedom real quick. You shit, you feel me? Like before anything. You feel is me? the like, jail mentality not like a good mentality to go into the studio with? Like people don't want to hear that energy. Um, I don't know what you mean by that one. Like, 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 like. Versus like, like tripping and shit, or like. All right, if you just, if, if Friday night you go out to a crazy party and you get a bunch of bitches and you're doing a bunch of drugs and you're having a grand old time, and then Saturday you go in the studio and you still are in that headspace of doing a bunch of fly shit, is that the environment in which you're going to make your best song? Or is it going to be after you just got done sitting in a fucking room with a bunch of lie, dudes like, for, like, for like, a year? My best songs like, like, like Letra and shit like that is when I'll be wilding. Right. When I be like, like, I be doing my shit, and then I be hitting the studio that same day, and I talk about what happened. Right. You know, so I just be, I be doing my shit, you know? Right. And when I get to the studio, like, okay, that just, you know? Like, that shit feel fun, like. Because I feel like a lot, a lot of artists have that perspective, like, I'm not going to be able to make a great song if I'm wearing my pajamas. That's, that's overthinking it too much. That's why I feel like a lot of rappers get fly as f to go to the studio, even though there's nobody around. I do that too, though. I ain't even gonna lie. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie because look, look, look. You, you put on all your chains model. and it's Here's just my you. Model. What I say, slash, what I say, if you look good, you feel good. Mm -hmm. You look like a million bucks, you're gonna get that million bucks. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And if you feel good, you rap good. And if you rap good, you eat good. God damn, nigga, I am hungry right now. <laughs> like, boy. <laughs> like, oh, God, and you're like. Yeah. You've been doing it for a long time. Do you feel like, is there like a sense of like, holy shit, there's a new popping rapper coming up every six months or whatever? Or do you feel like, have, have you earned your status where you're going to be respected no matter what comes out? Mm, like... I mean... A motherfucker gonna respect it regardless and shit. Cause like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can't deny my worth that thick either. You know, like, like I'm quick with it. Like, you know, I'm fly with it. Like I said, they ain't good with me, so I'm just like, you know what I mean? So I'll be okay. Like, like if motherfuckers respect that thing, gonna respect like the, the, the originality that I got. Mm. You feel me? Cause I know my hearing other full songs and be like, what the. F like Cheeto shit. Right. You know? Because to me, like, you're a younger dude, but then when I see somebody like Lefty coming out with the Cheeto flow, I'm like, oh shit, like, your influence is big enough that people are almost like giving you that OG status, you know? Yeah. Like, acknowledging that you've been influential on a lot of different people. Yeah. Shout out to him, you know? What do you think when you saw that song? Was that kind of crazy to just be like, damn, people really see my impact yeah you don't seem like overtly enthusiastic it's, 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 I'm not even gonna lie to you like you feel me like shout out to bro you feel me like Anybody you fucking work hard what the fuck is that Wait, the smoke detector or something I don't know, we'll be smoking in here all day. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, it's the TV. Oh, oh it's the beeping. Oh. <laughs> on the gang. <laughs> hey. It's get the charger. Ankle monitor. Nah, nah, my ankle monitor. Cool, brother. Like. <sighs> Dude, we're, we're never going to run out of funny shit that can just randomly oh. happen on this podcast because that's a first right there. Oh, Bro, it was man. so loud. I felt like it was coming from the ceiling. No, I thought it was the light. I'm like, what the I'm like, why would the light make a beep? <laughs> and then when you started, like, walking away, I thought it was following you. Okay, so back to your regular scheduled broadcast. Um, yeah, we were just kind of talking about, like, the next generation of dudes coming up that may or may not have been influenced by you. Yeah. How do you feel about that? I mean, good because like, I was influenced by other people. Good because I mean I was influenced by other fools too, you know. Mm -hmm. 
So like if I do that to somebody else and you know and they grinding hard because of it and shit nigga then shout outs to me, you feel me? For sure. Cause I can't lie, bro. Got crazy work that day too, though. Like he be grinding. I see him everywhere, bro. It was talking about him in the pain too. I'm like, what the hell? Right. I'm like, all right, that's what's up. Hmm? Definitely. And uh, you guys are on the same label, so do you think you'll end up working together? Right now, I just want to focus on me. Mm -hmm. You know, like, like bro got his wave already. You know, like let me get back into me. How continue where I left off. You know. Right. So like I told you before, like kid features. I'm not really worried about that right now. Let me show you what I could do real quick, you know? That's important to you to, like, mm -hmm. be able to show that you can maintain your, your status doing it yourself? Yeah. So I even maintain my status just, like, like, let me, like, let me just shine real quick, you know? Like, that's it. Like, I've been gone. I only got to shine, like, I only got, like, little 15 minutes of fame, you know? 